welcome to Travel and Style from Kuppe in Switzerland. Kuppe is a municipality in the district of Nyon in the canton of Vaux. So in this channel you will discover the little town of Kuppe and also the nice castle that is in Kuppe. Um, and if you're new to this channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button and that way you'll be discovering a new place every week or a hotel or a wellness and spa. So stay tuned and keep discovering with us. We would also like to uh, wish a warm welcome to all our new subscribers. Welcome to the Travel and Style family. So now we are in Kope, which is uh, a municipality that is not very, very far from Geneva. It's about 20 minutes uh, by car. So if you're ever in Geneva, uh, it's very easy for you to, to visit this uh, cute little uh, town. So here we are in the park of the castle of Kope. And uh, you will discover the beautiful castle from outside. Actually, the castle was the property of Anne Louise Germain de Stahl Holstein, who was a French woman of letters. And she was from Genevan origin. And she was the voice of moderation during the French Revolution. So she used to, to hold uh, gatherings in the castle and discuss many themes and also literature and uh, politics. And uh, today this castle uh, remains in the family of Madame de Stael. And uh, if you're ever in Kope, if you're ever in Geneva, Switzerland, and you come here, then you may visit the castle uh, from inside. And we will take a look at the opening hours for you. And uh, we will continue visiting the little town of Kope. So this is a very, very nice uh, area. It's a uh, very uh, cute, quite uh, quiet. So here it says the alley of the castle of Coupe is a private property, but however, it is open to the public to have a walk. And uh, of course it is uh, placed under surveillance. And here's the castle. So Cafe is super cute, it's really really cute, uh, lots of little houses, um, you know, I uh, will show you a little bit and then we will head to the lake. Look how cute this is.
super cute. This is uh, another street of Capet. Look at these uh, houses. How cute they are. It is really one of the cutest uh, little villages. So nice. And these are the famous fountains that we usually film in traveling style. So here we are in a residential area where people live. And where you also have a, a little uh, restaurants, cafes, such as this one, Le Perron. And at the end here you have the lake unfortunately there are works so I don't know if we can um, get to the lake from here look at this little uh, alley how cute it is So we are here in the downtown of Copé and as you can see there are cafes, you know, patisserie, chocolaterie and little shops under those uh, arcades and here we have uh, a meat shop and I mean Copé is absolutely adorable, uh, really really cute. Here we have a house. So there it is and uh, we are now going to head to the lake. So stay with us, don't go anywhere and keep discovering. So we are now by the lake and uh, this is the view you have. It's absolutely gorgeous. Of course, this is the Leman Lake or uh, Lake Geneva, as some would call it. But I prefer saying Leman Lake because on one side of the lake we have Swiss cities and on the other side we have French cities. So this is uh, the Leman Lake. We're going to continue uh, further uh, 
Have you ever been to uh, Copé? Have you ever been to this part of uh, the canton of Vaux? If you have, please let us know in the comments uh, section. We would love to know. So if you're ever here, you can also uh, sunbathe or practice all sports activities. This place is uh, really pretty and also uh, you can take the boat and uh, go places on the Leman Lake. So there it is. And we will uh, soon be giving a shout out and end the video. This is so beautiful, so relaxing, really, really nice. Really, if you're ever in Geneva and you want to take a short drive and discover another little town in the district of Nyon or if you're ever in Nyon as well, then Copé is really close to it. that we also have filmed so if you haven't seen our video of Ivoire which is in France uh, go check it out uh, you will love it it's a medieval city and um, otherwise uh, you can take the boat from here to go to Ivoire and back and the same uh, from Nyon and uh, uh, so it's really really nice. So to take a look at this uh, beautiful uh, boat And we will now give a shout out to John Bettel who has given us a very nice comment on the video of the City of Time of Omega and Swatch So if you haven't seen the video of Omega and Swatch go check it out and uh, I'm sure you will love it. And if you're ever in Bilbien, which we also have a video for, uh, you can visit the Omega and Swatch Museum. So that's it for now. And uh, we will soon go back uh, towards the castle and end the video there. So if you like this video, make sure to share it with your friends give it a big thumbs up like and subscribe by hitting the travel and style icon on the left of the screen or the little red button on the bottom right of the screen 
and that way you'll get notified of our next destination so stay tuned travel and style is signing off bye bye